Hello, this is Father Nicholas Sheehy. Welcome to day seven of our Novena of the Sacred Heart. Today we are looking at the patience of the heart of Christ. And I don't know about you, but patience is always a virtue where I feel very much lacking. And I think that it is also something that we see embodied very well in the heart of Christ and something that we can learn from Him. Let us begin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Patience of the heart of Jesus Christ support my heart. From the Gospel of Matthew. He proposed another parable to them. The kingdom of heaven may be likened to a man who sowed good seed in his field. While everyone was asleep, his enemy came and sowed weeds all through the wheat and then went off. When the crop grew and bore fruit, the weeds appeared as well. The slaves of the householder came to him and said, Master, did you not sow good seed in your field? Where have the weeds come from? He answered, An enemy has done this. His slaves said to him, Do you want us to go and pull them up? He replied, No, if you pull up the weeds, you might uproot the wheat along with them. Let them grow together until harvest. Then at harvest time I will say to the harvesters, First collect the weeds and tie them in bundles for burning, but gather the wheat into my barn. Then from Pope Francis, from a tweet that he shared. Jesus shows us the patience of God, the merciful Father who calls us even at the last hour, who does not demand perfection but heartfelt enthusiasm, who wants to open a breach in our hardened hearts. Let us pray. Sacred Heart of Jesus, you love us deeply and know every corner of our identity. Transform our hearts to have the same feeling as yours, the same way of listening, seeing, and speaking as you do. Purify us in the living flames of your love so that we can make you present here and now through our lives. Amen. Sacred Heart of Jesus, make my heart like yours. Well, hopefully as we're coming through this novena and getting now close to the end, our love for the Sacred Heart is growing and we're really getting ready to renew our commitment to spiritual intimacy with Christ and to have that contemplative aspect of our spirituality be lived out in our daily prayer. Have a great day. God bless.